here we will learn about the forward reverse starters or reverse forward starters for the motors so we'll see a power circuit as well as control circuit in this video so first we'll take power circuit for the forward reverse starters so we'll take three phase supply and then circuit breaker for the power supply or power switch and then we'll take overload relay protection relay you can say and then we'll take two contactors one is forward contactor and second one is a reverse contactor so left hand side is forward contactor and right hand side is a reverse contactor here you can see the all the faces red is connected to red yellow is yellow blue to blue and the output of the contactor it is important any of the two of the faces in a sequential way you can interchange so it will behave as a reverse so right hand side picture show uh, the MCB overload relay a forward contactor reverse contactor and similar way all the faces will will connect so here one thing is important which is very carefully you have to connect that any of the two faces should be connected in opposite way or you can say in uh, in uh, like uh, you can say uh, yellow phase to be connected with the blue one and blue face connected to the yellow one so that reverse function properly work you can take also an uh, any interchange sequential wise now we'll take forward reverse control circuit in this circuit you can see on the blue phase is for the forward contactor and the red phase red line shows the reverse circuit so we'll take mcb then emergency stop push button and forward no auxiliary contact and then we'll take a push button station with the one nc and one no similarly we'll take for one push button station for the reverse connections so here we'll take one no one nc and reverse no contact and one overload relay and reverse auxiliary contact nc and forward and see contact i will take two contactor forward contactor or reverse contactor these all auxiliary contacts are situated situated at the right or left hand side of the contactor so we'll take neutral first we will connect it to the overload relay and see and then it will connect to the both contactors directly but you can see here barrier is overload relay you can see also in the contact control circuit let us see how we can connect control supply will come through the mcb and the emergency switch and then forward and no contact parallel to the push button green you can say and no and then it will go to reverse push button station nc and then it will go to reverse nc and then to forward contactor in similar way a red line will show through the nc contact of forward and reverse and no and then you can see it is in a parallelly we have connected a reverse and no contact you can match with the control circuit and then it will connect to last reverse contactor the circuit is now completed if you see in the control circuit blue line is for the forward system and the red line shows the reverse control system so here push button and no nc and reverse forward auxiliary contact NONC is very important they are crossed so you can see forward contactor have a control of an uh, opposite and both any you know vice versa so when we give a power supply to the MCB it passes through emergency and come to forward push button station here you can see forward and no and no will not pass any power so it will go to next and through nc forward to the next reverse push button station but here no supply will pass when you press the push button station in a forward to push button station you can see the power will come through this and go to next through the nc contact and it will go to reverse auxiliary contact of nc and then it will start the forward contactor in this way our circuit is for forward starter it is completed in a blue line 
and our motor will run in a normal way if you remove this push button the automatically forward and no contact will hold it and make it live so it's very important to see this now if you press the stop button the power all the systems will stop so if, now suppose we press the reverse contactor push button station the power will come through and no and it will go to forward nc contact which is not working so now reverse contactor will got hold in this case if you try to push forward push button it will not work because there is a interlock for all both ncs you can see in a control circuit as well as in this live circuit so in reverse forward if you need uh, any accidental avoid any accident such a chance you can add a timer and all the things to make it more safer but in this way you can also it is also safer way but it, it is a basic structure next video will show you how we'll add a timer uh, to this forward reverse control circuit to damage reduce damage so if you remo uh, remove the push button station um, contact now if you st stop the push button all the power will cut and nothing will work all the system will remain at stationary position only live power will come to this if you like this video share it for query you can comment in box for latest video subscribe this channel and press bell icon button thank you